As I previously reported, your boy Molly Maul, the music producer and rapper from Love and Hip Hop Hollywood season one, you know, he suffered the loss of his cat, Nyla, who happened to unfortunately pass away in a house fire. Now, if you want to see some actual pictures of the aftermath, click the link below, visit my blog. There's a link that'll take you to the TMZ website. Because I'm going to read to you a story from TMZ, and up there, you know, they have different pictures and whatnot that I can't post here on YouTube. Also, I posted a video on my blog which is from the TMZ website from this article. Molly Maul's wearing a face mask and he's carrying this big black plastic bag with the carcass of the cat inside of it. So there's nothing graphic or anything like that. The cat's inside of a bag. He didn't let the cat out of the bag. He just put the bag inside of a freezer. Anyways, here's what TMZ had to say about it. TMZ writes in a quote, Molly Maul cannot bear to let his beloved pet that perished in the fire go. So he's taking steps to preserve it. Norman Bates style, Team Z broke the story. Molly's pet Carco Nyla died last week after his Vegas home caught fire. The rapper dashed to Vegas from LA where he was taping his new reality show, Beats and Bullshit. We're told Nyla is currently tucked away in Molly Maul's freezer awaiting an appointment with a taxidermist who will preserve the pet, which will probably earn a prize spot in Molly's home. Thank you Team Z for that news and I guess Watch out for Beats and Bullshit with Molly Maw's new reality TV show. R.I.P. to Nyla the Carkle. And people, would you ever freeze your pet? It, now, re, now, mind you, this is a refrigerator like the type that you would have in your home. And he had, you know, like an empty freezer. So it's like a, it's not even like the type of freezer that they would use, you know, at a professional facility, I guess. But like an actual commercial home freezer that you would have in your kitchen would you ever freeze your pet whether it's an exotic cat or a small puppy etc would you ever do something like that now nah, i know <laughs> i know some of y'all would be like hey, i freeze my own damn child i know somebody's thinking that right now but uh, don't post that below no as a matter of fact yeah post that below if you would do some shit like that because we need to know who you are but anyways, R.P. to Nyla, you know, my condolences to Mr. Molly Maul because he unfortunately, he had to put the pussy on ice. And, you know, anybody who's ever had the ice down a pussy before knows how that is. It hurts. Well, let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine. There's also a photo on the Teensley website where he's kissing the pussy goodbye. Ain't that something? And no, I'm not kidding. I'm just saying literally. But R.P. to Nyla, I personally could not <laughs> freeze my cat and then taxidermy it. I, I could not do that with a pet personally. It would bring back bad memories for me to see the corpse of the deceased that way. But just because I wouldn't do it doesn't mean that you wouldn't. Would you do something like this? Let me know below. <gasps> Meat Magazine.